Hello, welcome. In this short video, let us look at the Laplace transforms of second and higher derivatives. So we are looking at Laplace transforms of second and higher derivatives. So the definition can be given as follows. So if Laplace transform of a function f of t is equal to f of s, then Laplace transform of f double dash of t, that is second derivative of the function f of t is equal to s square f of s minus s times f of 0 minus f dash of 0 that is initial value of the first derivative. Now let us derive this result. Laplace transform of the second derivative is equal to by definition integral of 0 to infinity e power minus st f double dash of t dt. Now using Laplace transform of the first derivative that is defined as s into f of s minus f of 0. So by using this formula in this integral, the integral can be rewritten as 0 to infinity e power minus st derivative of f dash dt, f dash of t dt, that is, this is the second derivative of f of t, but it can also be written as derivative of the first derivative. Now by using the Laplace transform of the first derivative, we can write this result as s times Laplace transform of the first derivative, which is f dash of t, Laplace transform of f dash of t minus the initial value of this function, which is f dash of 0. Now by you, again using the formula for the first derivative, that is Laplace transform of the first derivative, we have s times s times f of s minus initial value of the original function minus initial value of its first derivative. Therefore, Laplace transform of the second derivative is equal to s square f of s minus s times the initial value minus the initial value of the first derivative. Now by sim using similar logic, we can derive the Laplace transform of the nth derivative. That is, this is equal to by definition integral 0 to infinity e power minus st nth derivative of the function f of t dt. The nth derivative of f of t, that is function f of t, is equal to the derivative of n minus 1th derivative. dt. By using the formula for the first derivative, the Laplace transform of the first derivative, we can write this one as s times Laplace transform of fn minus 1, that is the n minus 1th derivative minus the initial value of this, the initial value of n minus 1th derivative. Now, by using the same formula on the n minus 1th derivative, we have s times s times Laplace transform of function with n minus 2 derivative minus the value at the initial value of this n minus 2 the derivative minus f n minus 1 of 0. Thus by recursively using the formula for the Laplace transform of the first derivative, we can write that the Laplace transform of the nth derivative as s power n into f of s minus s power n minus 1 into f of 0 minus and so on s into n minus 2 derivative the initial value of this n minus 2 derivative minus the initial value of n minus 1 derivative. So this is the Laplace transform of the nth derivative of a function f of t. Thanks for watching.